me that you're into so many things and my latest modality they asked me how are you into access bars and what is access bars so my reply to them my answer to them is like access finds you it's not that you choose your you choose the access access chooses you so if you hear about access again and again so it's your time to to find the ease freedom joy glory and magically everything will start happening to you so how access came to me my brother told me send me something like pod and park do this right and wrong good and bad pod and park online church boys beyonds and he told me do this so that time povod wasn't there so that is the clearing statement of access and he himself didn't know much about it so what he did he sent me this you know you do this and your life will change you do this and it will become so you know everything will become so easier for you so i said yeah okay and i did not believe him but i am being inquisitive today is my happy birthday as well so i'm being inquisitive like i'm a queen so that's why i'm saying today is my happy birthday so i'm recording this video on february 3rd according to indian uh, calendar but in canada it's still one day more to go a couple of hours more to go so he told me pod and park and your life will become easier and you will have so much um, you know abundance in your life so all that sort of thing he was telling me and i was being inquisitive so i searched on google on youtube and i sent him a bigger pdf of those four lines and my critic my my analytical mind is in critical mind my analytical mind was like you know i was analyzing it i was wanting to more wanting to know more skeptical i was ah uh, hmm i was i was skeptical about my brother because he always uh, tells me all the good things but i was skeptical about whether what is this like inquisitive basically so i searched for it and i found um some resonance with it some energy was pulling me towards it and i ended up registering myself so the place i was uh, running out before so uh, near that place like 15 minutes away from that place there was a lady she was conducting a class in september and that was september 2021 so i registered myself i paid and then i went there so first half of the session i was like this is landmark this is they're talking about judgments they're talking about choices they're talking about stories possibilities so all this i have you know i'm already learning it in landmark so what's new here and then after some time they were teaching us their points on head like aging dosta here and money control connectivity here money control connectivity here creating life forms creating connections so so many points we were being told there was a video being played and i was like i am indian huh? and we know more than these points you're telling me 32 points and i know 144 points so what are you telling me new and i went there i like you know you need to set your intention so i said that my intention today is to not to be judgmental and otherwise also i uh, because that's exhausting when you judge something or somebody especially somebody it's like you're making them wrong and you're seeing some some personality of yours in them and that's that's what it was and i was like hey so i caught myself judging again and then that happened and then i was like you know i was asked so the next part of the session was uh who wants to gift who wants to receive because in this session um you would receive two sessions and you would gift two sessions so it's like a balance game and you're learning to receive those who are not receivers and those who are givers and those who cannot give they will learn this uh, giving as well gifting as well because life is what it's gifting and receiving it's not only taking taking or only giving giving it's both the things it's a balance it's yoga it's a balance like yoga it's like you know balance so i would say it's kind of a extreme practical kind of yoga which is balance so i 
I said, like, I'm a giver. And my, I'm very masculine because I'm single mom and doing, you know, give more, giving more giving. And I'm yoga teacher, so I'm give more giving uh, personality than receiving personality. I think that um, uh, imbalances my feminine uh, body, which is to receive. So I wanted to have a balance in my yin and yang. So I set the intention that I don't want to judge. And right that time when I said, like, I'll, I'll gift first, when I was gifting, actually, I was receiving. Hmm. There was a Chinese lady, and she was on table, and then whatever points I was, I was, you know, there is, these points are for time, space, and communication. And the moment these points I pressed twice or thrice, like, I touched it lightly for her, and then for another person, then for another person, like that. So for for a few sessions, uh, these points will give me choking because I wasn't never able to express myself. So all the vulnerability which I am, you know, showing on social media, like that wasn't me. I would pretend that everything is rosy and everything is uh, going good and I don't need you. Like, you know, I am not weak. Because if I'll say that I need you, if I'll say I need support, I am weak. And Priyanka is not weak. Um, and so I wasn't vulnerable so much so before. So this change happened. So coming back to that table thingy, and I felt so super light. Like I am into yoga. I feel light mm, on daily basis. And I choose to be light. But here, magically, I was experiencing that this lightness is something like somebody is giving me spa. And it's like a head massage. And head massage, that too, like a light. Because one of my friends, she was like in the next second class. One of my friends was so contributing that she wanted to press it and give me massage also. Because the next class, I did not go alone. I took two of my friends and went with them. So, because I liked it so much. And when I, I found when it was touched, like feather light touch, I was being contributed more. And I was feeling that head spa or complete body spa. It was like a deep level of spa experience. And for three days, I was into a different zone. And then within a month, I took seven classes, like, Five, two more, seven classes in a month from September 16 to October 16 or 30th. I took seven classes from September to October. And it was such an experience that after one session only, I, I thought that I will contribute it to people, to masses. This is, you know, I am a contributor. I am, I would love to share. So I will do that. And that's what happening right now. Every month I am organizing classes. I am doing access bar sessions. I teach yoga. I give people diet according to their blood value and also according to their temperaments. Uh, I use Ayurveda in it and energy healing in it. And this access is something, uh, you know, another tool in my toolbox mm -hmm. to be able to help people feel their bestest feel light from within so that's what I do and this is how I found access and access found me and then when I, once I shared it with my students so they were like yeah we used to do you remember you you used to tell us uh, the points in the head so I remember like I, almost a year before I went to Access, Access came to me. One of my students uh, named Jyoti, she was saying, I have had a Priyanka, can you do something for that? And that day I remember we do, we did like that. I'll show you, so I'm holding my laptop. So I'll show you. So both hands were here and like on different points on back of the head and everybody was like so, like this. And other hand will go that, that side. So we did that and we felt so good. And whenever I teach yoga, it's intuitive class. I We plan that the class is going to be an hour. The class is going to be for full, full body. And then whatever needed to come to us, I channel that 
So that this is what I am into. And this is how access came to my life. And via, via me, I am now a medium is coming to your way. Choose it. If you want to expand, there are many other ways, but this is the simplest and easiest and fastest way. So choose. Uh, we are doing access class almost pretty pretty much every month, but this time it's like February 12th. It's in Brampton. So choose and I'll see you in person soon. Let me know that like, you can text me, you can message me, you can comment below in this video and let's get connected and let's see what is there for you. And if you want to know more, even in that case, you can text me, comment below or <laughs> no calls, message me.